enough for Texas families and Texas values. It's time that we had a United States Senator that will stand up and fight for every Texas family. Don't you agree? But I'm going to tell you right now, standing up for Texas families is not about me. It's about us. That we've all had enough. That we've all had enough of the course that our state and our nation is on. And let me tell you what we do as Texans when that's the case. We all take the step forward and we answer the call to service. Here in Corpus Christi, as I mentioned before, in the body of Christ, this is where so many times the effort has been led for social justice with the creation of LULAC, with the creation of the GI Forum. So many movements for the betterment of Texans and of all of Americans have started right here. And that's why this day that we're gathered here together, we are starting the movement to take back this state for Texas families, and you're going to make it happen when you elect the next United States Senator from this great state of Texas. <laughs> I'm honored to be here with you this morning. We are incredibly blessed. And I ask you now, we have an election on March the 4th, and we have another election in November. Mr. Cornyn, we need to let him know when was the last time he was here? What has he done for the Coastal Bend area? Coastal Bend, Coastal Bend area now deserves and needs a United States Senator fighting for them in Washington, D.C. And with your help, I'm going to be honored to be that United States Senator. Thank you very much, and thank you for being here this morning.